Hey guys, so we are officially back on the road, on our way back to Ohio, reluctantly. Colleen's trying to plan ways to live in Vegas, and uh, driving out of town here, I don't blame her. This view is amazing. Gosh, it's, uh, it's gorgeous, and uh, it's hard to leave, but... We will be back home. We're probably going to take our time. We're in no rush. We are uh, on our way to uh, the Grand Canyon right now. Uh, so, hope everybody's having a wonderful and amazing day. And thank you for watching our Vegas vlog yesterday. Um, and for the whole week that we were there, uh, we just kind of decided to condense it into one. So, onward and eastward. the bridge here we are actually now leaving Nevada and we are heading into Arizona the bad thing about that bridge is they do not give you any views of the Hoover Dam it is all blocked and you cannot see anything from the Hoover Dam so about 50 miles away to yeah. the Grand Canyon. In a, a beautiful drive here through Arizona, which you just saw the first portion of. A lot of mountains, a lot of good scenery, things like that. Colleen has had a good time making some good remarks about the shadows um, no. on the ground, from the clouds, why it's dark and not no. light. Yeah. Dude, what, so, what we saw was not a cloud. It was totally a cloud. But Kylie wanted to let you guys know that we are actually on Route 66 right yeah. now. The historic Route 66. So we will see you guys when it's we get... in the woods. We are in the middle of the forest, it looks like, here in Arizona. Lots and lots of trees. But we will see you guys when we get to... Alright, so we've made it to the Grand Canyon. So we will uh, see what all the fuss is about with the seven natural wonders of the world or whatever the hell this thing's supposed to be. So I guess we'll see in a second. So this is a visitor center. Normally it would be open. Today it's closed. It's closed. For sure. 
Let's bounce this back there. Wasn't it? That's the Grand Canyon. And those people are nuts. So was Colleen, who is in flip flops and not making gear. What's your impressions of the Grand Canyon? <laughs> What's your impressions of the Grand Canyon? It's a big hole. It's, it looks almost fake. It's pretty, That's what everybody says. Right. It looks fake. It looks freaking huge though. So now we're going to Mather Point. Ooh, look at that guy right there. Hi. So you have one deer here and another deer here and a whole busload of people just got off the bus and they don't know how to pass. It's kind of funny. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed the Grand Canyon. We enjoyed it. It was a lot more beautiful and awe-inspiring. Animals, animals everywhere. Awe-inspiring than I thought it was going to be. Um, I think we're definitely going to uh, make plans to come back and camp here so we can get more of a... Uh, and not wear flip-flops. And not wear flip-flops because, you know, we were here for about an hour and a half and it's just not long enough uh, to do hiking and riding bikes and, you know, seeing everything that the Grand Canyon has to offer. So I think we're going to make another trip to come back. But enjoy yeah, the pictures. For anybody that wants to know. It's like once you enter to just come in to like the park before you get to see the Grand Canyon, it's thirty dollars no matter what, what per car. Um, good for seven days. Good for seven days, but then you can pay like another fee if you want to camp and stuff like that. But just to enter the park, you have to pay thirty dollars. Right. Did not know that. So, uh, FYI, this is day one of our road trip home, which is technically day four of our road trip. Um, we have now officially entered 
the home address into the maps and are on our way home, which is not fun to do because it just you just know that you're marking the end of your trip. Um, but we have three more days to get there, so we're gonna take our time. So hey, Kyle, what was your favorite part about the Grand Canyon? Well, I don't know. The animals? The animals? What? These guys? Those guys are pretty cool. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna insert. I get it. Anywho, no. And if you so, if you guys like do want to camp here, it's probably like a 10, 10 minute drive, like into the park until you actually see the Grand Canyon. Smoking. Until you actually see the Grand Canyon, you can edit that. Until you Good actually up. see the Grand Canyon. Um, Try but again, we're, if we're, you want to camp, try to get started again because if we're gonna edit all of that out, I have to cut all of this out. So like, you know, you pay the thirty dollar thing. You come in and say you want to camp, so you're camping, la la la. But if you wanted to take like another ten minute drive out of the park, there's actually like a town right there, not far at all, and they got a bunch of restaurants and some bars and hotels and lodging and stuff like and, that. And yeah, if camping's not your so, thing, they definitely have yeah. hotels right outside. Or you could come and camp and eat your wieners and, and burgers and breasts. Your wiener? Do you want to eat your own wiener? Yeah. Um, but then, like, say for like one night, you just wanted to go in town and have dinner. You can do that too. It's like right there. Kyle's tip of the week. There it is. Tip of the week. <laughs> hey guys, end of day four for the road trip. We just got to the hotel, got some dinner. We're gonna relax, get to sleep, wake up early in the morning, and uh, get back on the road. So, we'll see what happens tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Remember, as always, you guys are awesome thank you so much for watching be memorable live memorable and for me and Kyle's peace out